This is the most demonic place we've ever been. Oh my god! I keep hearing a banging. I swear I've just seen a guy sitting there in a wife beater. Children around you. <gasps> oh. It's me, Mackenzie, and welcome back to my channel. We are on a haunted ghost ship right now. I have a UTI. I have a heat pack on. We are here with some of the best ghost hunters across all of YouTube. Kelsey Davies, Oh My Gosh TV, and The Barrier Beyond. Don't mind me, I just got a UTI. We're going ghost hunting, boy. The Queen Mary was originally a high-class, high-speed cruise liner. As World War II began, the Queen Mary transformed into a troop ship. It was painted camouflage gray colors and stripped of all of its luxuries. The Queen Mary was the largest and fastest troop ship to sail. On the 2nd of October, 1942, carrying more than 15,000 American servicemen, the Queen Mary collided with another ship, taking the lives of over 200 crew members. The ship sustained minimal damage, after the war, the ship was painted back to its original colors and once again was a high-class cruise liner. In 1967, the Queen Mary docked in Long Beach, California, and she's been here ever since. For a ship that's almost 90 years old, there's countless stories of strange deaths taking place. Drownings in the pool, falling downstairs, being smashed between watertight doors. The most chilling of all is the demonic presence that resides in room B340, making believers out of paranormal skeptics. This ship has had a very grim history. Tonight, we are going to be going on the most haunted ship. Welcome to the Queen Mary. I am in my pajamas. <laughs> oh Jesus. Look at how spooky this is. <gasps> Room tour. I was in a silly goofy mood of a UTI. It's for a drop of spooky dookie. <sighs> That's where you'll find me most of the night on the toilet. Coming on this way, we have our two twin size mattresses. No one cares. Here is where we have a little party. We have a porthole. <gasps> Imagine the people who like looked out these windows during war and stuff like that. I'm on a boat. Let's do a paranormal investigation now, okay? Okay. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna change real quick, okay? Yeah. <coughs> I'm just casually dying. What just happened? I just literally puked out of nowhere. <coughs> this is great. I don't know what's going on. The ship. Do you think it's the ship? It's taking its toll. All aboard. First class ticket. Felt like Rob's Only 40 feet longer than the Titanic. Yeah, it feels like this is what the Titanic would be like. We've made it to the Titanic. I mean, the Queen Mary. It's time to start our paranormal investigation. There's no one on the ship! This was a warship. People used this during the pandemic. Without a doubt, this place is extremely haunted. This is where they would get telegrams at. Anything, this was just communication to the outside world. It is really creepy being on here alone. This is where kids used to play when they were on the ship. Look at this lifeboat, original. This is lighting. We should like stand it up. Right, we good. Oh, look at that lantern is going off. It's going crazy. I like to come here. What? Oh. Right as that goes off. Maybe because nobody comes in here. Yeah. I asked. <laughs> Were you the one who sniffled in here? And it said, yes, I did. What? Tony the ring? You. They're We're following, following you. But we are being followed for sure. We are. Tony's E2, don't try it. It's a mirror. Just don't try it. That's weird, it's a broken mirror. What the hell is E2, E21? Oh, a man here. A man here. A what? Here. A man here? A man here. We're in a random room right now. It looks like it's being renovated. Kelsey heard someone sniffling. Yeah, and then it said like, I asked if there was someone who sniffled and it said, yes, I did. And then it just said a man here and it said, we're following you. Yeah, and look, the room going on. Whoa. You know, earlier Omar was like, are my friends in danger being in there? And then that thing out there was like spiking. Yeah, and it said I was conjured here before I walked in. I swear to you, I was like, who's here? I, sw oh, look, I don't ever see stuff, 
I swear I've just seen a guy sitting there in a wife beater. I swear to God, I want to be like there's someone in this chair. Look, 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 look. The road. And in the bathroom. What is going on? Going there's someone in this chair. Look. I'm getting I, chills right now as you're saying that. So now we're here like feeling bad for myself. Harm. What? Whoa. They mean, they mean, you, mean, harm. mean you harm? So we are in danger in here. Peter sent me in, in a wife beater, bald guy, and he was literally just slouched over on the chair. The bathroom's got weird vibes. What did it say? The lights. The lights. Maybe All of the like big the lights. lights. All the lights? Your flashlight. Even off. my light, yeah. Maybe he doesn't like the light. Maybe he likes the dark. Even though there's just like a lot of us in here, I still feel creeped out. Yeah. Is there someone in the bathroom right now? Someone overdosed in the bath. Oh, I think someone died no. in there. So his thing said bled to death. So maybe somebody killed themselves. Like, slit their wrist, maybe. Yeah, that was the vibe I got. Someone died in the bathtub. Inspire. Inspire. Either they overdosed and then did. So I keep seeing pills. Like, I just keep seeing pills. And then they're. Th when Kelsey says she sees something, it's because she's a psychic medium who can see visions from the past, present, and future. And she can talk to ghosts. Things said bled to death. So maybe they took pills. You're seeing something, Kelsey? Yeah. Maybe he overdosed and did something. In the bathtub, I just have a weird. <gasps> wow. Yes. Yes. Maybe they they didn't decide to take their life in the bathtub, but they ended up dying in the bathtub. Oh my God. Yes. Whoa. Wow. They died in the bathtub. He's trying to show me something, but I'm trying to. It's just the same thing over and over. Do you know why? figure it out he just keeps showing me the same thing with his arms up and he looks out of it like he, i don't even know you know how tiffany said he was sitting on the couch he like, like out of, that's how he's be like careful. be careful yeah that's how he's showing me himself like his head's back and his he just doesn't look right he looks um like he's about to overdose drugged out yeah. maybe gotta play that again bro Okay, so explain what happened again. So they were in the empty room, and I walk in, and I thought there was just a person, like like a worker person in there with them, because I saw a heavyweight guy with a wife beater kind of just like slouched down in the chair. And when I walked in there more, I'm like, okay, there's not somebody in here. And of course, I never see stuff, so it like freaked me out. Kelsey sees the same thing, describes it to a T. Before we even went into the Before room, we even started doing anything. We were all kind of just hanging out in the middle, and there's a staircase behind us. Mm -hmm. I was at the top of the staircase, and this guy said, excuse me, and I went like this, and I kind of moved this one. It was this fat guy with a wife beater, sweaty, bald, came down here. This is the crazy part. He's been recording the whole time on this camera. Oh, right there. There he is, and it just cuts. And like it cut your footage off. It cut the footage. So it just cut, cut by itself. Yeah, we don't cut that short. So do we just like get it? Someone? Did it's we like get we the guy? Well, I, don't kinda, know. I have no idea. Well, you yeah. even said that he looked angry and like sweaty and out of place. I saw his face. He didn't make eye contact with any of us. He didn't even look at us. We're outside the ballroom right now. We're about to go inside. Whoa. This is so cool. They're ready for us. They're ready for us. Is there someone at the table? Of a woman. In 1989, two women were sent to clean this lounge. They entered the room and found a passenger sitting on a chair in the middle of the dance floor. She didn't say a word. As the employee started to call security, the passenger faded away in front of them. All of the women reported seeing her fade away at the same time. I feel a woman here. Can you touch this device? There's a woman here. So there is the ghost of a woman she's seen in a lot of the ballrooms. And I know there's a woman here. Surprise. Surprise. <laughs> there's somebody here. You should dance and see if like, yes, yes. <laughs> Are we working it? Oh, it 
chicos, we love your dancing. Can you dance with us? Would you like to see the worm? Oh, would he bust that one out? Oh, I can do the worm. She's like, just you wait. <laughs> That's actually so impressive. Did it just say the worm? I swear to God, if it's like the worm. Mm -hmm. I was doing the worm and they were like, they really liked it. Eight seats, eight of us. It's time for a seance. Hide. Hide? <laughs> and seek. <laughs> Are we in danger here? Who's the boy that's here? Whoa. Whoa. Children around you. Oh. That's different a completely one. different one. Yeah. yeah. Same Yours one. said boy, and then this one said children are on you. Okay, the key going, going off too. Were you dancing with me? Yes. Yes, they were dancing with her. She killed. She killed. She killed. I killed it. Oh. I killed it. Can you guys show us some dance moves? Who can help me? Who? <laughs> yeah, you were. They want some assistance. Yeah. Are you a man? Can you light up the device? Absolutely. Whoa! Why eight chairs? And there's just enough chairs. Yeah, exactly eight of us. Like, that's we just weird. We wandered in here last yeah. minute, too. Like, just... That entity's here. Can you light up one of these devices? That was definitely a noise. Hello? Is there someone here? I swear someone just said hello. Hello? Whoa. Children here. Is there someone in the room behind us? No, it's just like That's tables and chairs and stuff. Yeah, There's that nothing literally sounds like someone walking. Yeah, I know. Every time I feel like somebody's gonna come, they never do. Yeah. yeah. Should be scared. Oh, Ooh. that's fun. Why? Should be scared. Or, why should we be scared? Head. Head. I ain't scared no head. <laughs> no. Down here is the most haunted room on this entire ship, B340. This part of the ship feels completely abandoned. Here, but if you go up one floor. Did you just hear something? It sounded like a growl. Did you hear that? Fainting, fainting spell. spell. We reached B deck. My mother stumbled back against the wall and was out of breath. When we asked what was wrong, she said she had just seen a figure of a woman gliding over her right shoulder. She said the woman seemed to disappear in mid-flight right against the wall. This is 16. That's where I heard the growl. You didn't hear that though. You swear that wasn't your stomach. I swear it wasn't me. If you turn the light off, it's completely dark. Look at that. It's just going off. It's literally just going off. So they don't let people stay here. They don't let people stay in that room because of the things that have happened. People have seen demonic things. It looks like a nice ship, but this is the most demonic place we've ever been. Is that it? I don't know, they took the things off. They literally took it off. Wait. <gasps> Did you see that one all the way red? Yeah. Is there something behind this wall? I wonder if the wood's stopping it. It's shaking right now. Is there something dark back here? They completely removed the tag. Like they don't even want people coming down here. Your light keeps flickering. Is it literally flickering? Yeah, it's literally flickering. Oh. Oh my god. It's literally Holy like my other hand is literally in my pocket. The light's literally flickering. I know there's Yo. something back there. <laughs> it shut your light off. That was crazy. That was crazy. I do ghost hunting. I do not hunt demons, okay? A very big difference. Hey, don't wander off. This is just like parts of the boat that no one goes on anymore. It's back there. I'm scared. Okay. We just filmed all down here in the bottom part of the ship, which no one comes down here. It was like maybe 20 minutes of footage. My battery was at 75%. I keep hearing a banging. Well, my battery completely died. So we lost all that footage. 
We keep hearing something down here. Basically, this is where the engine of the ship is. So your battery was at 75, instantly died. Yeah. We lost that footage. We put the old battery back in that was at 5%. It goes mm -hmm. up to 30%. 30 what the hell? Danger, high voltage. these doors it was flooding in here this door would like lock airtight shut is that outside the ship no that's inside the ship i think this is the ship that's crazy that's insane <laughs> if we get lost down here Full-blown panic attack. Let me see. Yeah, hey, don't look in Kelsey's hole. No, it's not Kelsey's hole. hole. It's everyone's I, hole. I know you we can look in Kelsey's hole. We all own the hole. It's our hole. Kelsey found it, though. Yeah, it's my hole. Oh, well, I hope she can Then you, you explore her hole. I'll explore her you hole. You explore her hole. Into the hole. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That is the boiler room. Your keys. At least we're going down. <laughs> oh, it's stopping. We end up in the boiler room. I don't even know what floor we're on. Did you yeah. hit an M? It works. Oh, that's him. Really. Yeah, this is it. Push the doors open. Oh, wait. The doors are stuck. Typically, I don't spend the night at locations that I do paranormal investigations at just because I feel like it's like bad luck. Tonight, I am spending the night here. It's about to hit three o'clock in the morning. I'm really scared to go to bed. I know that a lot of the spirits on this ship are like friendly, but I also think some of the scariest things are on this boat too. We're not turning the lights off tonight. We're not doing we that. No, we're not. We're, we're turning the lights off. No, we're not. Uh, I'm gonna make her. No, we're not. Well, Sorry. I feel like we should leave the REM pod on. You have to like physically touch it. I think I'm gonna keep that on and just like let it sit over there and if it just goes off in the middle of the night like it does. If anything too crazy happens, I'm literally packing up all my things and I'm leaving. I swear to It God. just started going, do you see it? Don't play with me right now. They literally are trolling. It's time for bed. I'm going to sleep now. The REM pod's on. We'll see what happens. I still have a UTI. I slept like crazy crap last night i was talking and turning the whole night i literally had a nightmare we slept with lights on i made it through the night nothing bad happened <laughs>